Hello, Oscar fans. It's Oscar Knight, and I'm Kevin McCarthy bringing to you my Oscar predictions. Uh, it's uh, February 24th, 2019, for the year of 2018. Um, <coughs> let me get start off by saying these picks are just what I think will win. It doesn't necessarily reflect on one of my favorites or what I choose, what I would would want to win um um okay let me just get right to it uh for the short films to get them out of the way for best animated short film i have bail uh for best short film live action i have marguerite best documentary short subject i have black sheep um best visual effects i have avengers affinity war for best editing i have vice but that's Production design, I have The Favorite. Best Cinematography, I have Cold War. Um, best Costume Design, I have The Favorite. Um, best Makeup and Hairstyle, I have Vice. Best Sound Mixing, I have Bohemian Rhapsody. Best Sound Editing, I have First Man. Best Original Song, I have Shallow from A Star Is Born. Best Original Score, I have Black Panther. Best Foreign Film, I have Roma. Uh, best Documentary Feature, I have Free Solo. Best Animated Feature, I have Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. Um, best Adapted Screenplay, I have Can You Ever Forgive Me. Best Original Screenplay, I have The Favorite. Best Supporting Actor, in a best actor, best supporting actor, I have Mahersha Ali in Green Book. Um, best actress in a supporting role, I have Rachel Weisz for The Favorite. Although I'm rooting for like Regina King. <laughs> Sorry, I'm rooting for Regina King. Um, I guess because Rachel Weisz has won BAFTAs and Regina King was nominated for BAFTA or Screen Actors Guild. <sighs> Um, I, you know, it's like I'm trying to, I me mean, this year's hard without the Oscar, or I know that it's going to change, it's, it's a really hard to predict this year, sorry, um, but I'm going to go with Rachel Weisz, because she won BAFTAs, I'm going to say, she, give her the slight edge over Regina King, um, same as Mayor Charlie, Green Book, I think, um, he's won everything, um, and so, and he's a great actor. Um, he's the, uh, I do think that, and I love Simon Elliott in A Star is Born. Um, and I, I really liked Richie Grant and Can You Forgive Me? I think if they, and he won, Richie Grant won the Independent Spirit Award for Supporting Actor. But if, if there was an upset, I, I, I wouldn't be surprised if it's Richie Grant for Can You Forgive Me? But I think Mahersha Ali is a lock, as good as a lock for Green Book for Supporting Actor. So I'm going to get Ricky White's the favorite. Although, I also wouldn't be surprised if Regina King won for If Bill Street Could Talk for a supporting actress. Um, for, for lead actor, I, I as much as I want to hope for Bradley Cooper for A Star Is Born, I think it's Rami Malek's Bohemian Rhapsody all, you know, you know locked up. He has that locked up. He's won almost, he won SAG and won BAFTAs. Um, I think it's Rami Malek's all locked up. Um, and if there was a surprise, it might be Christian Bale for Vice. Um, for Best Actress in the Lead Role, I have Glenn Close in The Wife. Um, although, she won almost everything you know, except for a BAFTA. Olivia Coleman won for The Favorite for BAFTAs, but I still, I give Glenn Close a slight edge um, for the Oscar for The Wife. She also did a really great job in The Wife as well, too. For Director, I think Afonso Caron for Roma. Um, I think he, he's he's won everything. It's his, it's his losing one DGA, which ninety five percent of the time predicts the winner of the of the Oscars for best director. If there is a surprise, it might be Spike Lee for Black Klansman, but that's a rare uh, rare surprise. I think it's Alfonso Cuarón all locked up, and for best picture, again. I really liked the Stars one this year, and I thought that's the best picture of the year. Um, but I don't have, I don't think it's going to win. I think, uh, it's going to be Green Book for Best Picture. 
Um, I know a lot of people thought were Roma, and it could be Roma. Um, I think the three chances of it, it would be probably the favorite, Roma and Green Book. But I think Green Book, because it has won the price for, it the Oscars Best Picture is a prefer, preferential ballot. And the only other guild that has preferential ballot is the Producers Guild, which eight out of, eight out of ten times have predict, predicted the Best Picture. Therefore, I'm I'm gonna go. Oh, the odds of Green Book is gonna be the winner for Best Picture. All right, that's Kevin McCarthy, and those are my picks for this year.